Come on, pup. They say real Northwesterners don't use umbrellas, so Eva fits right in. Come on, baby. Good girl. You'd never know she was born in a landlocked town and dumped by a human who didn't care. Well, my sister actually found her wandering the streets of Sacramento. Giles adopted Eva and brought her to the upper left, where an unexpected skill turned her into a celebrity. Our joke is that she's a, a Disney princess. She was on Disney Plus's It's a Dog's Life. She's also been on PBS and the BBC twice. All because of this nose and who it might save. She's a trained scent detection dog. So she's a conservation dog. She aids us with our conservation research. Nonprofit Wild Orca monitors the health of the 75 remaining southern resident killer whales. Eva is able to pick up the scent of their scat. In layman's terms, she's trained to locate orca poop. Dinner plate size down to literally the size of your pinky nail, as she can still find it. They get shipped to our lab at the San Diego Zoo Wildlife Alliance, where they analyze those for stress hormones, nutrition hormones, pregnancy hormones. So, so many things can be analyzed by just looking at one scat sample. It's also a non-invasive way to do research. Eva's sense of smell is so powerful, the boat never needs to get close to the whales. This isn't just the pursuit of knowledge, it's reverence. This is actually a piece of a wetsuit that was the favorite toy for Tokate. And so we keep that close and remember that everything that we're doing is trying to save her family. Eva may not realize the gravity of it all. She's in it for fun. The reward for sniffing out scat is a toy and quality time with her people. She's just such a lovely being. Literally, people's faces light up when they see her, and she just has that way of bringing out joy in people. A stray puppy found, helping save another species before they're lost.